Go ahead. Can you talk to me about that time between 12, whenever you found out you were going to have a baby that night and then getting to the hospital that feels like a threshold moment in a way where you know something's going to happen but yeah. it's not yet there what was is there anything meaningful or worth sharing about that six hour period it's a great question um i think a couple things um one both my wife and I wanted to have like lunch together, like after the ultrasound. And because she was going to have the C-section that night, she had to fast for eight hours. And so I remember like not getting to do some things that I wanted to do before the baby came specifically with Laura. So I remember that like standing out. And then I also thought that I wasn't going to go on paternity leave until like two or three weeks later down the road. Um, and so I'm thinking like, I still have time to max perform and get everything tidied up and just stuff wasn't all tidied up. And so there was a couple of things that I like did for work to get off my plate. Um, or, and then, uh, I think the other thing that I was remembering is like, she, I'm trying to like put myself in that moment. The other thing I wanted, like more time with the boys, I think like it was kind of like rushed to take care of a couple of things, get the car seat ready, pack a bag, all that good stuff, um, get the car seat loaded. And I remember like still playing with the boys, but you know, they had no idea really, like they didn't process that they were going to have a sister that night. So mm. I think a couple of things where I just wanted a little bit more time, or I wanted a little bit more control on when the baby was going to come, um, as opposed to like finding out that day that, you know, we were going to go into the hospital that night, but it was, it was awesome. Like, it was just like super exciting. Like, you don't really know what to do. So you do random things. I'm like, I'm just like killing time to like go to the hospital at three 30. And so, you know, I took out the trash and like, <laughs> I did like, like dad, dad chores or something. Like, what should I do? Um, but yeah, it was really, really, really special. Um, and then I always liked the time before Laura goes in for the actual C-section. So this is Laura's third and there's like this one hour time period where no nurses are coming in. Laura's all like prepped and ready to go, like in her, uh, in her surgical gown. And we're just kind of like chilling there. Um, and it's, I don't know, it's kind of fun. You know, we both like, we're getting tired and then we'd like talk about the baby coming. So it was just kind of like a things, you don't have like a window to see outside and like what time of day it is. So you're kind of like, yeah, sealed up. Like from the stacked world. thresholds. Like yeah. there, are, there are thresholds within thresholds within thresholds. Yeah, uh, you're not good. Exploring here. 